have moments that just like there's like this coming together of things and you're just able to kind of like look at the big picture but you know like an accumulation of time and like how much you've had to sacrifice and the like amount of resourcefulness and it's strange because I'm really grateful and proud of myself and I don't regret it especially because of being able to like make sacrifices for my kid or for the most high like that means the most to me but the lack of like social and the, and the relationship struggles and all the things that have gone through just us and not having the support and the resources that we need and everything and then I have come or go so many months doing it everything on my own not everything but everything that I can and having a conversation with my mom and she's like yeah well you're just gonna have to you know you just gotta be resourceful like I just have to just accept like no options like I said that to her I was like I got us in this situation and we don't have any options and then I found myself again in, the, in a place where I'm speaking this, these things to the wrong person but I also needed it to to come back around to that realization for me that it's like I don't I don't understand I don't know if I'm ever gonna understand why it's been the way it's been like why have we not had more support for the amount of time that it's been and um, why has everything been such a struggle like not everything but most things and it is what it is I don't want to be I don't want to be I want to come back to gratitude um, but it's it's really wild y'all this journey is takes all of your heart and in that way I think it's really beautiful <laughs> this Sasquatch on that sign um, it's just it's wild to me because it's like it's like people who have it all in the physical but don't they don't there it's just this voraciousness I mean, I remember that as well because that's how it was for me too before. It was like I wasn't present and it was like, it was always, what's the next thing? What's the next thing? What's the, what do I need to tackle? It was like, it's just this never ending cycle. So I really, I recognize that maybe, maybe people in that state don't even like, don't even like look at it, like stop and be grateful because their mind is always, they're always going on. Sorry, I'm getting distracted by things. Um, so, there have been so many beautiful moments, and I don't want to lose sight of that, and so many sentimental and special things that, and that, so much of that I'm so grateful for that I was able to experience with my kid. Um, but it is hard. It is day by day and it's it not having more options or financial security and those things. It, it does suck. It's just, it's an interesting trade-off, but I do think that things happen the way that they do for a reason and well there will be a time that we can look back and understand and putting out there abundance for everyone and fruitful relationships and taking a break from the day-to-day -day at some point going on an adventure putting that out there for everybody